Sneak back in the house, back in the house, back in the house. Hello, everybody. How are you? Today, we're back with PC and Linux OS. This is the LXDE version. Basically, normally comes KDE as standard defunct stuff. But I thought we could have a bit of LXD going down. It's simpler, it's lighter, or lighter than normal. So it gives you a different perspective or view on your certain distro. As you can see, it's very blocky. Very blocky, very blocky. But it is LXDE, so what do you expect? But it ain't going to use too much of stuff, is it? As you can see up here, it's not using much of my CPU whatsoever, is it? No, not at all. It's basic LXD layout, you know, got top bar and bottom bar, or whatever you want to call them. <clears throat> Down here we have the on and off button, that we like to Time. Over here we have, hello, my interface. Hello, we're fully installed and updated, or, or waiting five minutes before checking up. Right, I just to start it, obviously. As you can see, it's Friday, October the 17th, 2014. It's nearly 10 past 8 in the evening. Yeah. Anyway, so we're going to have a bit of a look around. Now this particular version, although it's rolling release, supposedly, this particular version was only released ooh, a few weeks ago. Okay. So it's Hunkly Dorley Super of the Duper. Yeah, baby. Okay, we have two workspaces. We have desktop 1, desktop 2, desktop 2, desktop 1. We have left click to iconify all windows, as usual. The next one here is Fire of the Fox, lovely jubbly. LX Terminal, Synaptic Package Manager. Configure your computer, that's nice, as I'll show that. If you're used to Mandrake, Mandriva, etc., and Ilk and Magia now, obviously, you'll know what I'm talking about because it's very similar, okay? And configure your LXDE desktop, okay? And then next step, we have PC Man FM, the file manager. It's been going yonkies and yonkies and yonkies, yeah. So, and here's our menu. Now, it comes in quite light, this one, so it's nice, 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 okay? So, under more applications, you get configuration, bloody loads, look at that. I'm not even going to bother going through after them, really, because you can just get it and look yourself, really. Because you actually can try it in live mode if you really want to. Under development, we get the icon browser. Okay. Emulators. Well, they don't actually give you any. It just says get Oracle Virtual Machine Virtual Box. Okay. That's an emulator. Would you call it an emulator? I wouldn't really know, but anyway. Monitoring. Okay, over here we get an alert clock. Batty. I am your Batty boy. For your battery. LX Task Manager for all your running processes. Should we, yeah, should we have a look? Why not? As you can see, I'm only using 113 megabytes of my RAM, which I think is jolly good show, old chap. You're going to run about 5% of the CPU, I okay? think. Only two crawl this one, by the way. Yeah, it's yeah. all rather nice, isn't it? That's what it says on Latin, anyway. Yeah. Where was it? Yeah. Yeah, we're we'll carrying this on, okay. Monitoring. <clears throat> Net Appellate. Shows list of open windows, a sleep timer for automated shutdown. Now, why don't most distros have that to like, make you go to bed so you stay up till three or stupid clock in the morning? And system info, so shows your system info and hardware information. Check out your printer, so as an Epson Injet manager as well, and the um, Inkjet, it is I am. HP and Lexmark tool are really supported quite well. Now, many moons ago, Lexmark wasn't actually supported very well. It was terrible, actually, but now it's a lot better. So all your main printers are there. The main printers that they don't like are Canon and Brother, for some reason. You can get Canon printers to work, don't get me wrong, but Brothers are a pain at the posterior, okay? And okay, we've got the terminal, so we've got the LX terminal, the root terminal, and the X terminal. Do you like terminals? Oh. You've got file roll roller and simple burn. Simple burn is just simply for burning, so I'll open it up for you so you have a quick look. See, some of the programs I've got here are a little bit different to what you'd normally use, aren't they? Don't you think? Yeah, of course. Of course, I'm right. Silly. File tools. Should we have to go first? There's only leaf pads, I don't worry about it. File tools. Desktop preferences. PC Man FM, as we've spoken before. Root PC Man FM. Schedule and Unison. Under graphics. This is as standard, by the way. It's only a small download. You get PDF Viewer. You get Foxit Reader as well. That's also a PDF Viewer. GPIC viewer, image magic, screeny, and Xane for scanning. So your multifunction printers will work out of the box. Firefox as defaults, I said to you before, the network center, the PC Linux OS Knowledge Brace Browser. No, I'm gonna open that. A browser for PC Linux OS. I'll open up it. Oh, I've got all day. Five, four, three. Oh no, we're getting there. It's slow. It's slow. Well, that is. Who knows, as they say. So I'll keep looking. Oh here we are. We're here. Make it a bit bigger. It's still open. 
Oh, but here we go. Look, that's the reason why. Look. Introduction, get chess and install. You know, that's pretty nice. Basically, it's a wiki. Wiki jungle is massive at the end of the day, isn't it? How to get it? Oh, look at all these over here. Mm, 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 mm. Nice. I'm like. Oh, by the way, if you still want KDE, they do a mini me as well, as well as a main and a Monty. All right, a main and a Monty. Yeah, I forgot to tell you about that bit. Uh, I'm not particularly a KD fan, so it's never been a preference for me, to be honest with you. Anyway, we'll carry on. Where was we? Intranimers on, weren't we? You also get Pigeon, Slyfid, and X-Chat for your RIC. We'll open up the Fox and you can have a quick look at how we do the business in PC Land. So, yes. Little bit of thing for you. Many moons ago, <clears throat> it was actually based on... What was it? Is it Mandrake or Fedora? Yeah, well, yeah. Mandrake. Right, okay. But now it's what has gone over is when you open up a Synaptic Package Manager, you automatically think, oh, I'm using dev files. Well, no, it uses RPMs as a start stuff. Oh, yeah, baby. Oh, yeah. Didn't know that, did you? See? No, 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 no. Okay, we'll go over to the goggle. No, I don't want to break the law, do I? You know what I mean? I don't want to break the law. No, 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 no. Well, we'll go to the bubble care. Because bearing in mind, all your codecs are supplied by default in theory. You know, in theory. You know what I like about living in the UK? The BBC, BBC are not going to have me shut down. Because <laughs> we own them. Yeah. Anyway, that's enough of that. Yeah, so Firefox works. Uncle Joey out. Oh, lovely, lovely. Under Office, you get Abbey Word. I have PDF you and Fox is looking for. Calculator and the LibreOffice Manager. Now, basically, you have to download LibreOffice, if you know what I'm saying. You know what I'm saying, don't you? You have to download it. Yeah. But you still get Abbey Word. Now, I'm not sure what version of Abbey Word they're using. Well, I would do if I clicked it correctly and we could do that, couldn't we? Abbey Word 3. That's what it says on the tin. Oh, yeah. Nice. I'm not sure if I like this style, though. Maybe not my cup of tea, but you may like it. You may do. Where's my alarm going off me? I'll turn that off. Anyway, next. <clears throat> the software centre. You get Dupe Clean for cleaning you Get your virtual box, a LibreOffice Manager to get a complete profit, basically. The QT update notifier and synaptic. Remember, as I just said to you, it actually runs with RPMs, not dev. Okay. Just to tell you. you get Dead Beef as your player, a G Mixer, Media Analyzer, PC Linux OS FLV MP4 player, and that's what that plays and converts. Pulse Audio, you know what that means. QM Play 2, XFSA, and for video, you get Menco, go back, Mencoder, their own one again, QM Play, and UM Player. See, some of the stuff they use is not the same, is it? No, not the same. No, I don't want to use this but I'll open that for you. What the interface do I want? What I wanted English, really, didn't I? But only give me US. Go without them, won't we? Maybe that can sit you know what I mean? So you can go and browse stuff and do what you want. So in here, in theory, if I open up nice and big, if I put me in, obviously I can look at my own stuff, don't I? You know what I'm saying? Yeah, you know what I'm saying? I can look at my own stuff, I'm not told the whole thing to do. And all my stuff is there. So if I just click on one, see what happens? You know what? Why not? Let's see what happens. And in theory, it should open in the browser. Oh, come on. Okay. Okay. And it's playing it, okay. Right, I don't know what uh, options are. Here, an option should show me how I can make it in a better quality because it's playing high quality, as you know. But anyway, it's running all right. Yeah. This is the days when I used to have a really long intro. I don't do that so much now. No, because it's naughty. Okay, anyway, that's enough of that. Blowing my own trumpet, if you know what I mean. Yes. Anyway. If you like this sort of thing, okay. Oh, I've got some updates to do down there. I know what to do. Let's have a look. 17 to be upgraded, one to be replaced. Mm -mm -mm. Okay, while okay. well, I'm finishing off, I might as well do them, might I? Here we go. What should we do? Let's open that and we'll find out what we're going to do. That's your password. If you like the look and feel of LXDE, you're going to like this anyway. But if you want something a bit different, PC Linux OS has been going. Quite a long while, been longer than I've actually been using Linux, to be honest with you. And it could be the one for you. As it has to use RPMs and not DEBs, it gives a bit of a different flavour and feel. Obviously, if you like KD, you'd go with a KD one. Mark all that place while I'm here. Okay. If I mark the right place. I'll do that in a minute. Anyway, we're not finished talking to you. 
If you like the look and feel of it, and the way it's looking now, it's very, very nice it is too. You can customise it to your heart's content, you know what I mean? I like it anyway. I really do like it. But I wouldn't use it as my main system. It would only be for a copy or a laptop that I would use it for. But on the whole, it's very, very, very good. I like it. Sneaky Linux Gainette. I'll see you later. Bye-bye.